Now over to Garissa County where the county has had a water shortage for four days running following a technical issue that remains unsolved. Now Nelson Ngonyi has more on that story. Garissa Town and its environs has been hit hard by a water shortage that started four days ago paralyzing businesses in the northeastern town. The most affected businesses being hotels, car washes, lodgings and slaughterhouses. Businessmen in the area say the county officials responsible have not bothered to communicate and did not warn them of what was about to transpire. <laughs> Residents of Garissa are now forced to either fetch water from the heavily crocodile-infested Tana River or purchase a 20-litre jerrycan of water for 50 shillings. The latter option giving water vendors an opportunity to make a killing in sales. We had a breakdown on the rising main on two points. Uh, my team, the engineers, uh, technicians and plumbers have been working for the last two nights and now we are almost uh, mopping up the operation. Uh, in the next three hours we'll be able to pump water to the system. For now, the residents of the town can only hope for the best and wait for the precious commodity. Nelson Gunyi, Citizen TV.